Leap revealed the lightly refreshed Renegade subcompact crossover earlier this summer for the European market, so it's only natural that its fraternal twin, the 2019 Fiat 500X, would get a very similar type of makeover. Currently the refresh is only confirmed for Europe, but expect similar changes to arrive in the US visually, it's only subtly different. The headlights now feature LEDs for both accents and forward illumination, and they're slightly reshaped. The taillights are now rings that have body color inserts in the middle, similar to those of the regular Fiat 500. The rest of the body is pretty similar to the current one, but a number of character lines have been given sharper creases. The interior is also pretty much the same except for a revamped instrument cluster. The big changes, as with the Renegade, are under the hood. Three gasoline engine options will be available, two of which are turbocharged. The smaller of the turbo engines is a 1.0-liter three-cylinder engine making 120 horsepower and 140 pound-feet of torque. The larger turbo engine is a 1.3-liter four-cylinder engine making 150 horsepower and 199 pound-feet of torque. Interestingly, there's no 180 horsepower version of the 1.3-liter engine listed, as there is with the Renegade. There's also a naturally aspirated 1.6-liter four-cylinder making 110 horsepower that's a carryover from the old model. Diesel engines will continue to be available on the 500X as well. They're all four-cylinder engines in 1.3, 1.6, and 2.0-liter displacements, from 95 horsepower up to 150 horsepower. Four transmissions are available to connect to these engines. They include a 5-speed manual, a 6-speed manual, a 6-speed dual-clutch transmission and a 9-speed automatic. Front or all-wheel drive is also available. Of the powertrains available for the European market, the turbocharged gas engines are probably the only ones coming to the US pricing hasn't been listed for any markets, but expect that and U.S. market specific details to come later this year.